Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, my name is Osman. Uh, today we're watching one of the uh, greatest films of all time according to my friend, uh, Braveheart. Um, thank you guys so much for recommending it to me, um, I've been really meaning to watch this movie. I, you know, My mom loves this movie, she always talks about it. Uh, she says Mel Gibson was incredible in it. So yeah, um, uh, my mom loves this film, so that's one of the big factors that I want to want to watch this. And I also made a poll on my Patreon and this one. So I'm guessing it's also very popular in that in that arena. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. I have no idea what it's about. Uh, I think it's Irish, so that's all I know about it. Maybe Irish, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, um, I heard this one of the greatest films uh, uh, Mel Gibson was a part of. So I'm looking forward to see him and his performance and the incredible world that the, the world of Braveheart is. Uh, it's got a pretty high score on IMDb and I really wanna watch it, so. Yeah, thank you guys so much for recommending it to me, and if you want to see the full version, full length react, full length version of some uh, video, it will be on my Patreon. Um, I don't post, you don't need your own copy for mine, I post it right here. So yeah, I think that's pretty cool, and yeah, can't wait to watch it, and without any further ado, let's get right to it. Also, please feel free to recommend any other movie you'd rather, rather have me watch next. I really want to watch Last Samurai and The Last Kingdom. Those were the other options on my poll. But uh, they didn't win, but I still want to watch them. So, yeah, I also want to watch Signs. I, in due time, I will. But there has been a delay because uh, I am, I started to pack. I am moving out of here. Uh, as you can see in the back, I got my boxes. And that's Wally right there. And that's a paper mache thing I had to do for my art class. But, yeah, um, yeah, just feel free to let me know about anything, uh, any movies, any facts about the movie I'm watching, or any movie you'd rather have me watch next. I love to read your comments, I try to respond to all of them, but I've been really busy so far. Um, sorry about that if I haven't responded to you. I will in time. Yeah, without, sorry, but this is a long intro. Um, without any further ado, let's get right to it. Braveheart. This music gives me chills. Mixed with the mountains. Oh my god. I don't know why, but I'm getting goosebumps, dude. It's so beautiful. I just love the Scottish pipe, dude. Scotland, 1280. But history is written by those who have hanged heroes. Oh my god, that's so true. Scotland's nobles fought him and fought each other over the crown. Oh, damn. That's right, his blood will not be left with that. I don't know what to say, bro. They fought like Scotsmen and won every That's right, man. <laughs> They won their freedom, bro. That's incredible. This oh, this was directed by Mel Gibson. Oh my God. Randall Wallace. Written by him. Was it like was it, is this historically accurate, like hundred percent? Oh my God, that was such an incredible movie. So powerful. I don't know what else to say. Incredible. Wow, that was an incredible movie. I, I'm such, I'm in awe right now, dude. That was an, I can't believe I've never seen that before. It was so inspirational, bro. But yeah, um, I, I can't believe what I just witnessed, to be honest with you. This, this man fought and bled and died for freedom. Freedom for tyranny. I guess I'm, I, I don't think I've ever experienced anything like he did before. Cause it's like, I, to have a, such a big drive for something like that, it's it's so inspiring. It's so inspirational to look at, man. But yeah, um, my initial reaction, I just uh, my like I just took away three things. Uh, I, it's about freedom. It's about fighting for your country and about betrayal. Um, that was the biggest takeaways, man. Oh, it's about love too. Yeah, love, fighting for your country, love, freedom, and betrayal. His own people, the noblemen, just kept on betraying him, dude. Like, time and time again. I, I can't believe his own, the noblemen, like, I can't believe they acted like that. It really made me angry. It was so hard to see. But I'm just so happy that the leader, Bruce, the leader of the Bruce, the 17th Bruce, I, I hope I'm saying, I hope that was him, but he finally saw the right thing to do, but it took him some time. But I guess that's, it's hard to be a leader, and he was being deceived by his own father. So that kind of sucked to see, but man, Mel Gibson, I just want to say 
hats off to him. This was such an incredible performance. I, out of all the movies I've seen Mel Gibson in, this was definitely the best. And I haven't seen a lot, but man, I th- I think this was the first movie I saw Mel Gibson in. To be honest with you, it was incredible and such an it, incredible performance. I love this movie. I love the culture of the Scottish people now, uh, Scots and Irish people. I, I th- at at the beginning of this video, I said I, I think it's about Irish people, but I didn't really know a lot. Even though it might not be 100% accurate, now I know the kind of the history behind Scotland and England. and I mean, I, of course I know some things, but I didn't know this for sure. So, yeah, knowing this has now opened my eyes a bit. Of course, I'm pretty sure it's kind of skewed towards making England look bad. But from the standpoint of this movie, I, it, they, they were totally in the wrong, in my perspective. Um, no man should have the first should have a night but uh, no man no matter who you are where you're from whatever the law says you cannot have the first night of a married woman you know what i'm saying like that should be between a man and a woman that's newly wed you can't just take that away from a woman or a man like that's inhumane and if that was true this is historically accurate i can't i can't stand with that bro like the law is unjust, and you can't trust the law. It's like there's some things you don't cross. It, they cross that line, and that kind of set that was the setting off point for me to be like, yo, this is inhumane. Like everything that I've seen that they were saying was, oh, I'm in my right. Like England was saying, oh, I'm in my right. No, that doesn't mean anything. It's just some something that a man just made up, and it, it was literally the king made that rule up. Like, like like that so that was pissing me off and to see um, William Wallace's journey and his fight for freedom against tyranny his last words being tyranny I mean his last words against was freedom against tyranny like that's so inspiring and so powerful dude I can't like such an incredible inspiring person legend only one word legend bro he's a legend but yeah I love this movie uh, I love the the uh, I love the Scottish people and their culture, man. I love the Scottish pipes. Every single time they played, I thought I was Scottish, bro. I thought I was one of one of them, which made me feel amazing. Like it empowered me, to be honest with you. Like I felt incredibly, and I can't, I felt incredible. So yeah, I love this film. Uh, that was my initial reaction, but yeah, that was oh such an incredible. If you don't, if you haven't watched the movie, I recommend sitting down and watching it. It's such an incredible, incredible movie. But yeah. Um, yeah, that's, that's basically it, man. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this movie with me. Also watching this video. If you want, the full-length version is on my Patreon. You can check it out. There's also... I haven't made a new poll yet for the new movie. We're just watching the next Harry Potter movie next. But if you want me to watch something before that, or if you want me to watch something after the second episode of Harry Potter, um, please let me know so I can watch it. Um, thank you guys so much for recommending Braveheart to me. It was incredible. Uh, I hope to watch movies like this. Uh, I love, I guess... Medieval, is it medieval? I don't know, but it's just that culture. And speaking of that, it was kind of similar to like the ho- the uh, the tro- um, the dwarves in the uh, Hobbit movies. I I assume the like it was this is they got their inspiration from these uh, the Scotland pe- Scottish people. So seeing that the originality of that really made me feel incredible. So yeah, thank you guys for this recommendation. It was awesome. And yeah. Um, My name is Osman, and this has been my reaction to Braveheart. I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace out.